We are here enjoying, having a good time because we are celebrating his recent party right here on JC Circle Show. We thank God on Y254 channel all year. And so now today we are celebrating our second queen and that is none other than Mwangi Nimo. <gasps> we are honored to you having accepted our invitation. Oh, you were so kind. How would I ignore coming here? This is amazing. Thank you for having me. Thank you it's so an much. It's honor. Thank you so much. You know how it is. It's Easter. Yeah. Someone would say, no, let me be with family. Yeah. Someone would say, no, I'm on vacation. Yeah. But hey, we thank God you actually <laughs> accepted to party with us today. Thank you. This And this party is lit. I'm still getting over there. So I'm like, oh my gosh, it's so Woo. lit. Amen. It's Easter. For real, Jesus is risen. Amen. 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 I, I love Amen. This this party is amazing. Amen. Thank you for having me. Thank you so much yeah. for uh, accepting the invitation and actually gracing the party. Hi, Sal. So, yes. Hey, so I'm school, man. Uh, <laughs> no, uh, the last time we were here, Nimo, we had a new way. And yeah. uh, how has it been so far? And ukatoa ngoma ingine inaitua umefanya maku. How has it been? <laughs> Niwewe, Niwewe has was great. Mm -hmm. Niwewe has was surpassed what I thought. Mm. You know when you release a song you're like okay fine this is God, what, what God wanted but I really don't know how it's going to go. Mm. But it's a past what I thought. You yeah. know what God says that he's able to do exceedingly abundantly above whatever, over all that you can ever think ask or imagine. Yes. Yes. Yani, that's what ha Niwewe did. Mm. And I think it was just because the song talked about God's faithfulness. So mm. I think God just decided oh you're talking about my faithfulness. Mm. I'm going to show the world. I'm going to spread it. Mm. So Niwewe was a swift ride for me. Mm. And, and it went all over as in wow I'm, I praise the Lord for that. Wow. Yeah. So for me Niwewe exceeded what i thought wow, wow. yeah it, it was it was such a blessing it's amazing yeah mm -hmm. it's, it's really amazing so Niwewe was good god gave me another song yeah <laughs> talk about it sister talk <laughs> about that <laughs> actually in favorite ya sali me i know yeah. i know i know yeah, i know that song is a prayer every single mm. day mm. I, I talk about that song what mm. You know, because you haven't told us, by the way, mm. what, you know, led you to actually go through that journey of, you know, having that song produced and finally released to us. Wow. Um, first of all, I wrote this song. I won't say it. I wrote it for a long time. Mm. Mm -hmm. It was less than maybe 10, 20 minutes. Mm -hmm. wow. Done. Mm. I thank God for, I was attending 40 Days of Glory. Mm. I felt the Lord led, uh, leading me to do that. So shout out, big shout out to Kathy Kuna and mm. Bishop Kuna. Mm. So I wrote it during that time. And it was one of those days when you really are not having a good day. And I went to the balcony and uh, God said, reminding me, I've done so much for you. Mm. Because Niwewe came from a heart. Yes. But then Umefanya Maku came from a point of God reminding me, Hiya, have you seen what I've done? Yes. Have you seen the way I've showed up? Mm. Huh? Do you see the way, what I'm doing for you? Mm -hmm. And then I was like, Niwewe God Umefanya Maku. And I remember God telling me, you need to fix things in the supernatural. I mean, I mean the spiritual, sorry. Yes. I, I say it's the natural spiritual, the same mm -hmm. thing yes. for me. Mm -hmm. uh, the spiritual, so that it can manifest in the physical. physical. So for me, it was God, umefanya maku. Let me test mm -hmm. God and I say, umefanya maku. But then, I also have to say this. So umefanya maku, it's a declaratory song. It's a prophetic song. It says, it is. God, umefanya maku, so yes. you don't have to worry. Yes. But then, mm -hmm. this is also another song that shocked me. Mm -hmm. Because, I, you see, I wrote this song from a point of, okay, God is reminding me this. And he gave me the word Deuteronomy. I have to quote this verse. Yes, yes, yes. I, yes. Have, to, <laughs> I have to quote it. Yeah. It's in Deuteronomy 20. And it says that during the, during the 40 days that you were in the wilderness, mm -hmm. You never ate mm -hmm. any bread. Mm -hmm. You never drank mm -hmm. any fermented drink. Mm -hmm. Your clothes never got torn. Your shoes were never worn out. I did this so that you may know that I am God. Yes. That's the verse, by yes. the way. So, mefanya maku, fine. But now, let me give you a testimony about uh -huh. this song, which I, I have not shared so much. Okay. God broke protocol with mefanya maku in that he gave me the song mm -hmm. and then gave me a testimony after the song. After. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Awesome. You see, he told me, fix things in there. Spiritual, Super, yes. Then you come, it mm -hmm. will manifest, yes. So, guess what happened? Um, mm -hmm. he gave me a testimony. Mm -hmm. I won't go into details, but okay. my my dad was pretty sick for a while, okay. So, I remember if you go even on my time, my timeline, I used to say, I'm going to release this song. You know, my director, Kabi, knows how I release song. Mm. So, I was like, he had already finished this product, he really liked it, mm. and he was like, Why are you not releasing it? And I'm like, It's not your time. I kept on asking God, I how to normalize project, why are we not releasing it? Yeah. 
And my dad, every time I would say, I'm releasing it next week. There's a time I wrote, I'm releasing it next week. Mm. Then my dad got hospitalized. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes, very, very critical. Mm -hmm. Actually, he got filled in. And I remember telling him when he, got, he was getting filled in, because he was really worried. I told him, you know, I'm releasing a song called mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And there's no way I'm going to release a, release a song that yes. and you're not getting well. Amen. He, that cannot happen. Mm -hmm. So he got filled in. And let me tell you, I, I, he got admitted. And I told God, God, when I'm coming back today, yes. he, he got win, filled in in the morning. Uh -huh. Come back today. Mm -hmm. I want to see my dad heal. Mm -hmm. I want to see my dad walking. Yeah. Guess what? I came in the evening. He we came in. My mom could not even sit down. Oh, wow. He was healed. Amen. And it was critical. As in, we got in when, you know the way you get someone in and they just run. Yeah. And I told him, I remember telling my dad, just say this. God has already done great things for you. Yes. And I remember telling God, God, you, you gave me this song. Yes. Let it do that. And yes. it's a testimony. And Wow, so for me, for my family, who carries a lot of it, I and saw it. I so agree with you. I mean, it is, I remember it was actually one of my highlights. Yeah, sure, There's sure. There was a time that, you know, I was actually going through lots mm. of challenges. Mm. And all that, the, you know, like, you know, with the songs, yeah. you guys, I know you guys know, mm. but it's the songs that carry us. You know how it was with King David? Yeah. So it's like, it's the songs that carry us through the seasons that we go through, you mm. know? And so for me, I was like, that song just kept, you know, Aww. ringing in my mind. Oh, my family, my And I was, yeah. But then she sang. Actually, <laughs> Aliimba, Aliimba, your chorus. Like you want to put a message. Like you want to put a message. Like you want to put I remember, but it was. Stick to my hair. But that is powerful. I, I, I don't think you get that. That is really powerful. Mm. Yes. That it carried you through. Because you see, you. We don't write songs for singers. No. Mm. We don't write songs to entertain. Mm -mm. Yeah. If a song does not convict, if it does not change, if it does not heal, if Absolutely. it does not bring what change, mm. being born again, yes. being um, resurrected, yes. You know, yes, yes, resurrection yes, yes. into your life, mm. if it does not do what Christ did, is something wrong. Wrong with that song. So very, for that song, I, I really thank God. That's a yeah. testimony by itself. Wow. Yeah. Mm. Praise I, I God. Yeah. Amen. We really do. We thank yeah. God. So we're ready? We're ready to yes. actually... Yes. Uh, Leo, you know, it, let it come from the original mm. source. <laughs> eh? Yeah. <laughs> yes, and maybe wanna, maybe what one of the leaders, maybe yeah. after this, what uh, what one I expect, so that by the time to not talk, uh, yeah. yeah, people will uh, be expecting something from you. That to them, yeah. Um, first of all, Remember to follow me on mm. my all social media handles. Yes. It's at the Mwanginimo, at mm. the Mwanginimo. Uh, remember also you can get my music also on Boomplay. I yes. to say that. Because mm -hmm. uh, people ask, where can I get, even if you're outside the country, you can download the app and get it there. Mm. Now, what's next? More spirit-filled music. Wow. I, I really never give timelines because mm. I, even before, uh, also, I had other song to release, but God gave me this song in December and I wow. had to release it. So mm. if I say I'm going to be releasing a song next week, and then God tells me I'm not going to release it. It's nothing which I can do. Mm. But more spirit-filled music for the glory and honor of God. Yes. Yeah. And if you're going any, through any hard thing, just remember God, I'm a Yamaku. He has you covered. He has you at the, ba at the palm of his hand. Amen. Yeah. And you don't have to worry about the past or the future. God has redeemed you. You know, today is Easter. Yes. yes. It marks yes. everything being a Christian. Mm. Everything. Everything. It is finished. Done. Just know God got you and he loves you. And God, I'm a Shafanya. Maku. Maku. Yes. Okay. Absolutely. So I performing. I'm a fan of Maku Mwangini.